السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته بسم الله والحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على سيد محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين وبعد My name is Tanmir Hussain I'm an Imam in the local mosque in High Wycombe I pray you well I just wanted to make a short video with the hope that um, I could inspire somebody to make the right decision and hopefully save lives I, you know, with, along with my family we've just sort of come out of um, quarantine and we had mild symptoms and it was horrible you know, the whole experience wasn't nice at all um, although ours was an easy one in comparison to other people so I just want to let people know that the coronavirus is real and it's hor it's not nice you know and and it it can be very dangerous and we must all do the right things to protect each other and and those around us and and the communities in uh, as a whole in the morning this morning I received a phone call from a friend who's a doctor in one of the ICU units in the country and he had just come out of a shift and um, he was asking me what High Wickham was going to do in regards to the Friday prayers. And he shared with me, he goes, he had a horrible night. I said, why? He said, I was looking after a 45 year old Muslim man who handsome, mashallah, you know, had no health issues at all, apart from the fact that he contracted coronavirus and he has a wife and children. And because of the breathing issues, he was admitted into hospital and there he was, you know, two, three weeks on fighting for his life and losing the battle. Um, he's sedated, you know, and he's not responding to any medication and treatment. And his family don't seem to understand how serious he is because you sort of have to be in there to realize how bad it is. However, they wanted to speak to him. And even though that he can't really hear them, the doctor facilitated this phone call and allowed them to talk. And he goes, I had to listen to this mother, this wife of his talk to him whilst he's unconscious. And the children talk to him and, and give their messages to him. And he goes, it was so difficult to watch and witness. And this is what coronavirus is doing across the world and across the country. It's taking people's lives. Of course, when the time is up, the time is up. However, we have to do whatever is necessary to protect people around us and ourselves. You don't want to be that individual. You don't want that. You don't want that lady to be your your mother. You know your sister. Okay, um, your wife. No. So here, you know, we must make the necessary and the responsible decisions, inshallah ta'ala, and protect everybody around us, inshallah ta'ala, because our actions could save lives like that. You know, our actions could save many lives, inshallah ta'ala. Allah bless you. Stay safe. And keep everybody in your du'as. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen.